What is up, everybody? Welcome to Latest Study IQ. We're about to tackle a question that's haunted travelers for ages. Can you do New York City on a budget? And I'm talking like a really tight budget. We're talking $500 total for the whole trip. This isn't about just surviving in the city. It's about experiencing it, feeling the pulse, all without going broke. Over the next few minutes, I'm going to break down every single dollar, show you the hacks, the secrets, the spots that'll make your friends back home think you spent a fortune. Let's do this. First things first, you need a place to crash. New York City, the city that never sleeps can be overwhelming, especially when you're on a budget. But don't worry, we've got you covered. Forget those fancy hotels. We're going full on budget traveler here. Why spend hundreds of dollars a night when you can save that money for experiences and food? Hostels, my friend, are your new best friend. They're not just a place to sleep, they're a hub of activity and social interaction. Places like the HI New York City Hostel or the local NYC, they're not just a bed, they're a community. These hostels offer more than just a place to rest your head, they offer a chance to connect with fellow travelers. You meet people from all over the world, share stories, maybe even some travel tips. It's like having a global network of friends right at your fingertips. And the price? Way cheaper than any hotel in Manhattan. You can save a ton of money by opting for a hostel, and use those savings to explore more of what the city has to offer. Speaking of Manhattan, if you want that hotel vibe, look across the river. The views are stunning, and you get a different perspective of the city. Queens and Brooklyn have some killer deals on rooms. And trust me, the subway ride into the city is way more interesting than staring at a boring hotel room wall. Plus, you get to experience the local neighborhoods and their unique vibes. Now, if you're feeling really adventurous, there's always Airbnb. It's a great way to find unique places to stay that you won't find in any hotel guide. You can find some hidden gems tucked away in different burrows. From cozy studios to entire apartments, Airbnb offers a range of options to fit your budget and style. And hey, if you're feeling super brave, maybe try couch surfing. It's not for everyone but it's an incredible way to meet locals and get a real feel for the city. Free accommodation, meet some locals, can't beat that, right? Plus, your host can give you insider tips on the best places to eat, visit, and explore. So there you have it, budget travel in NYC made easy. Happy travels. All right, listen up, because this is crucial. The subway, my friend, is your lifeline. Forget taxis, forget Ubers, Grab yourself a seven-day unlimited Metro card. It's like 34 bucks and it'll get you everywhere you need to go. But honestly, the best way to see New York is on foot. Walk those streets, get lost in the energy, discover hidden gems you wouldn't find on any map. And hey, if your feet start complaining, hop on a city bike. 12 bucks for the whole day, or you can grab single rides for a few bucks. Oh, and speaking of free rides, you absolutely have to take the Staten Island Ferry. It's free, it's iconic, and you get the most insane views of the Statue of Liberty and the Manhattan skyline. Okay, let's talk food. New York City is a melting pot of cultures, and nowhere is that more evident than in its food scene. Because you can't experience a city on an empty stomach, right? The energy of the city is mirrored in its vibrant street food culture. Forget fancy restaurants, New York street food scene is where it's at. From food carts to pop-up stalls, the options are endless and delicious. We're talking $5 to $10 meals that will blow your mind. These aren't just snacks, they're full meals that can keep you going all day. And for a real taste of the city, you gotta try the classics. These iconic foods have stood the test of time for a reason. Pizza by the slice, a buck or two, maybe three if you're feeling fancy, is the quintessential New York experience, perfect for a quick buy, bagels piled high with cream cheese, street meat hot dogs, the options are endless. Each bite is a piece of New York's culinary history. And for an adventure in flavor, hit up neighborhoods like Chinatown or Jackson Heights. These areas offer a culinary journey around the world without leaving the city. Authentic ethnic food that's easy on the wallet and big on taste. From dumplings to tacos, the diversity is astounding. Now, if you're lucky enough to have a kitchen in your Airbnb or hostel, you can take your food adventure to the next level. Hit up a local grocery store. New York's markets are filled with fresh produce and unique ingredients that you can experiment with. Cooking a few meals yourself can save you a ton of cash. Plus, 
It's a great way to bring a piece of New York back home with you through the flavors and recipes you discover. All right, now for the main event, seeing the sights. New York City is a treasure trove of iconic landmarks and hidden gems, and the best part is you don't have to break the bank to experience them. And guess what? Some of the best things in New York are absolutely free. Yes, you heard that right. You can soak in the city's vibrant culture and stunning views without spending a dime. Central Park, my friend, is a must-see. This sprawling green oasis in the heart of Manhattan offers a peaceful escape from the city's hustle and bustle. Walk the paths, chill by the lake, people watch to your heart's content. You can even rent a bike or take a leisurely boat ride on the lake. It's a perfect spot for a picnic or just to unwind. Then head down to Times Square, soak up the chaos, the lights, the energy. This iconic intersection is the epitome of New York's vibrant spirit. It's overwhelming in the best way possible. The neon lights, the bustling crowds, the street performers, it's a sensory overload that you won't want to miss. Walk the Brooklyn Bridge, another iconic landmark, and the best part, totally free. The views of the Manhattan skyline and the East River are simply breathtaking. And for some of the best views of the city, check out the High Line, an elevated park built on old railroad tracks. This unique park offers stunning views of the Hudson River and the cityscape. Now, if you're itching for some culture, museums like MoMA and the American Museum of Natural History are worth every penny. These world-class institutions offer a deep dive into art, history, and science. But here's a pro tip look for free admission days or discounted tickets. Many museums offer free entry on certain days or during specific hours, so plan ahead and save some cash. And don't forget about those free walking tours. These tours are a fantastic way to explore the city, learn about its history, and see some of its most famous landmarks. You'll learn a ton, discover hidden gems, and maybe even make some new friends along the way. So, lace up your walking shoes, and get ready to experience New York City like never before, all without breaking the bank. So there you have it, guys. New York City conquered and all without breaking the bank. Remember, traveling isn't about how much money you spend. It's about the experiences you collect, the memories you make, the stories you bring back home. So get out there, explore, get lost in the energy, and most importantly, have an epic adventure. Peace out. With a bit of planning and these tips, you can enjoy the best of New York City without breaking the bank. Happy travels.